so we are at uh, the German name mountain. I can't remember the name. Berstolp. 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 But I believe we have reached the top of the mountain. So congratulations to all of us. We got we it. Say, we should say that we're on like three feet of snow right now. Yeah, here. Oh, oh, watch this. Watch this. more like five. Oh, that's all right. Up right. past my knee. Yeah. So that's that a good just three, four feet. We reached a summit at an elevation of 8,805 feet. Was it? Uh-huh. Woo! Very strenuous, but definitely worth it. Wait, guys, guys. Yo, uh, oh. oh. Wait, what are you? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Oh, okay. Ready? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Let's do this. Leroy Jenkins. And let's move on. So we're still hiking through some snow. We've met up with another group of people that is behind us. We're being from there. So, uh, we gotta make sure that we stay in the middle. That way we don't fall down and get trapped in some snow. At which point, you're about up to your knees in snow. At least for me, and I'm pretty tall, so I can only imagine what everyone else six foot under is going through. But, uh, seems to be making it pretty well. Yes, you gotta be ninja. Like a ninja. Oh boy, too bad I'm a cowboy today. Whew, that was a close one. How are you guys? Whoa, oh. I can't tell if it's on you or not. So it's right? Yeah, go. Where are you up in it? Here we are. Alright, we're gonna sign out for now. We'll check back with you when we make it to the lake. And probably a point two miles or point three or something like that. Well uh, point three three repeating of course. Yeah, exactly. Sign out. Rock frozen shores. Lake Berstolp. The lake founded like by the Germans. Fast, but we're not sure. Yeah. Very nice scenery. Now we know for a fact we're up 8,805 feet. Um, yeah. It's amazing. Very snowy. Oh, yeah. Very snowy. Did a lot of snow. But uh, very fun. Makes you feel great. It doesn't make you feel good. Hey, we we used to warm them. out here. Oh, my God. Oh. And let me tell you. There, we, on the map, it looks like we did so little, but we went to the freaking mountain. I know. Yeah, so the only way back, uh, back to our truck is to go back down the way that we came. Probably will be another half an hour or so, climb back down, and then uh, go find another go find another place to hike. Hopefully not so snowy place. Well, here we are. Taking a shortcut. Taking a little shortcut from the road. We just uh, pretty much climbed a couple mountains. And uh, we're taking a little shortcut down to the road here because we're lazy. Yeah, because we went the wrong way. We need to look back to the parking lot with the car. All right, I believe we are recording now. It is, this is day four. We are at beautiful Glacier Gorge here in the Rocky Mountains. It's phenomenal. We just climbed an amazing hill, managed to get lost, and uh, then have to climb an extra two miles. So now we're walking on the road somewhere back to our car, hopefully, which is not right there. But, uh, and you can see a true warrior in the mountains. Nice. Any remarks? It's been quite a day. It's been quite a day. It really has. It's been long enough, long back. I wish I would have brought my other shoes. Yeah, I might have put a water log. There's a map over there. But we'll get back and we'll have some fun at the campsite and maybe do some more climbing, we'll see. Who knows? Uh, maybe a little bit around yeah. the campsite. Yeah. Right. Make a little soup. Let's see, get to go. That would sound fantastic. Magpie and Pika's signing out. So I don't pass the camera off to you. Well, I have no idea. So I can get in the shot too. And here we go. 
talking to the car. I have no idea of a rough estimate of how far we've gone today. Maybe five, six miles, I would guess. So just this walk back on the side of the road it was at least two miles in itself. But it was exciting, that's for damn sure. Over now. Day five. Mm-hmm. We got up. Already very exciting. We got up only to find that our campsite was engulfed in snow. After which we cleaned up everything. I'm missing a glove. <laughs> Not good at all. Maybe I'll get some in Denver. I don't know. It might turn up. Yeah. It might turn up. It's more than likely lost in the bedding. You know. I still have hope. I still have hope. You'll find it when we get home. <laughs> Anyways, so it's um. It's really actually 9.16, this clock's a little an hour ahead, but um, we're heading towards Boulder, Colorado Springs, and then uh, Denver, and we'll end the night in Elizabeth. We'll just have to do a few hours of driving, and then uh, we'll take in the sights along the way. So, already a good start to an exciting day, and we will talk to you folks later. Here we are. And we're here with my cousin Margie, who... We both can't figure out what kind of relation we have, but, uh... There's no relation. But yeah, my mom just paid off someone. Probably. So, we're here, and enjoying some, um, homemade brownies. Provided to us. That was very nice. Very hospital. Yes, yeah, very yeah, hospital. Very hospital. <laughs> very hospital. Very hospital. Good, because I got this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, we're here, in the guest room here. And Elizabeth in her house, so. It's very cozy. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, we got. Elizabeth. We'll figure out. We did we got this Sonic. Yeah. 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 And yeah. now we got it fixed. We'll hit that later. Maybe get a job. We should apply for a job somewhere. We should now hire a job somewhere. I would love to do that. Well. Now full access to everything on Comcast. Any everything that's on that entire like on demand. Every TV show ever we can watch right now, or movie, or anime. Or not all of TV show. No, every single thing. Of course, of course. That's my last thing. We have literally everything we can watch because apparently the guy who works, uh, the guy who lives here, works it for Comcast. So he gets everything on Comcast for free. So he just gave us one of the boxes. He's like, here, you can use, yeah, just an extra one he had laying around. He's like, here, you can use this. So we, good thing we brought the TV and we didn't pawn it. So uh, now we now we've got everything to our. Your fingertips here. We got everything at our fingertips. I think it's on her anime. I think I saw it earlier. It's on her anime. It's on too. Yeah. And we also have uh, wireless internet. He let me use uh, one of the uh, USB links there. So we've got uh, full internet status, and uh, we've got all this Comcast cable. And uh, we've got a nice little room to live in here. I think, uh, I think we should just live here for a while, I mean, honestly. Yeah. Day six. I think. Yes, day six. Little Chris in the back. Man's like in front. Yeah. Our journey has basically been completed. Here we are out in the uh, Colorado Springs area. Very nice. Went through the gardens of the gods today. Try to get up Pike Squeak Creek. It's not fucking big. It's a big. It's a big. Jeez, that's going to look terrible later on. Alright, uh, but, um... Uh, yeah. Now we're heading home. It'll be like 18 hours probably. Maybe a little bit longer. But it was quite the journey. Indeed it was. Yes, it was. And I'm, I'm sure later in the night we'll have to uh, capture some more footage when we're all dead tired and putting our lives on the line yet again. Because we haven't done that in a couple of days. Here we are at... Nolan and 105th Terrace. My old stopping grounds from first to fourth grade. This is the stone that I used to sit on. This tree was not there. And I used to play Ninja Gaiden on those old, you know, handheld video games. Uh-huh. Right on this stone. Nice. Wait for people to pass on by. <laughs> Get a good one of the house, though. Okay. I mark my word that if I, in the future, will make an attempt to buy this house, because this was an awesome house. Want to yeah. do some reconnaissance? Sure. 
It's a little hard to see in the dark. Right there. That's where my babysitter lived. Yeah, right yeah. next door. Guy, a guy and a girl. Cool. The guy was cool. He wasn't the white zombie, I remember. That's before I knew who white zombie was. <laughs> um, We're going to do some sneaking around here. Oh, yeah. We're going to go. I, I know where some nice uh, progress there. I had a friend that was a few years older than me that lived right up there. And one day, um, I went over to his house and I left my bike by the side of his house. Yeah. And my mom didn't know where I went off to and she called the cops. And he was, he was walking around house to house with like a picture of me. Yeah. <laughs> Have you seen this boy? Right here. But nice. uh, that was one of the two times. The other time was...